Yo, 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 TSW here, and oh my god, this is not a World of Warcraft video, no, this is going to be an IRL video, oh my god, thumbs down, but seriously, uh, does TSW even lift? Um, it seems that a lot of warriors in particular who play World of Warcraft also go to the gym, so guess where I am going in this video? Yeah, the gym. Look at all the potholes on the floor so many and we got cool looking church okay so yeah i'm gonna go to the gym in this video and do a bit of recording if this is something that you would like to see more of please thumbs it up and uh, let me know in the comments uh, your thoughts because it's something that i wouldn't mind playing about with in the future um, and i found it fairly interesting to uh, record at least and if you guys like it then that makes both of us all of us and it just be cool so I'm basically a lot of this is just I'm just trying to not drop my phone so I'm recording on my phone and um, I was gonna uh, cut these clips up and make it a shorter more concise video but I thought I'd give myself the opportunity to actually speak in the video instead of just say hi I'm doing this I did that bye thumbs up and that'd be the video I'd rather have a, a more relaxed um, video style than something that's really fast. So I'm cycling, as you can see, to the gym. It's about a 10 to 15 minute bike ride and it's the 1st of November and it's a really warm day, about 15 degrees Celsius. Um, and that is a t-shirt weather, basically. Um, the sun's out, it's a very bright day, as you can see not a cloud in the sky so it's a very enjoyable cycle to the gym sometimes when it's rainy or cold you kind of have to uh, adjust your mindset and kind of think to yourself right i really want to just go to the gym today because i'll benefit from it so here's my uh, mug just doing a bit of recording whilst i'm cycling i'm sure i'm probably not meant to record while cycling but oh well um i won't even say that my ability to brake on my bike is uh, heavily impeded when I'm trying to record as well because uh, I only have uh, the access to one brake. So here I'm looking at my bike, fingers crossed it's there when I get back, it, it has been so far. I'm just walking into the little uh, shopping centre where my gym is situated. It's about one o'clock-ish on a Sunday afternoon so uh, yeah it's pretty dead. <laughs> So I'm just going to trot up the escalator and get my workout on. Will there be workout footage? Yes. I'll probably put something in the thumbnail of the video so you'll know anyway. Got to get that clickbait. People see someone working out in the gym. Oh, I need some motivation to do that myself. Oh, let's click this video. Boom. Thanks for the view. Uh, and hopefully thumbs up. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Please thumbs up. Subscribe. Thank you. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> so this is me just pulling faces in front of the mirror uh, that's my selfie mirror that I take selfies in after uh, at the gym so here's me just hunched over trying to s feeling really like uh, self-conscious recording in the gym like I've not asked if I can record in the gym and like later on the uh, the woman who's uh, the gym is like looking at me and I'm like you can totally tell what I'm doing. I'm trying to record in the gym. Anyway, I'll try and talk to the manager maybe and be like, yo, can I record? And he'll probably be like, probably, yes. Because I've seen some other people like recently last week record in the gym. They had a nice camera and they just had it on the floor on a really tiny tripod. And I'm just here with my phone jamming it in the equipment in order to try and get somewhat of an angle. So, yeah, I, I go to the gym. I've been to the gym for about... Eh, three years I'd say um, I used to weigh I don't know I might do a full video on like progress at some point but I've put on like a nice amount of weight since starting the gym I've not always been at this gym um, like three gyms that I've been to and looking at the uh, the timeline of the videos I think there might be a black uh, like half seconds worth of 
nothingness coming. I could be wrong, but it looks like there's a gap between the two videos. Anyway, um, this is lat pull down. Lat pull down, as in lat latimus maximus, or whatever the hell the muscle's meant to be called. I've done no formal training on fitness, so everything is kind of... Um, it's not bro science necessarily, um, but it is kind of... Um, a lot of it's just my, my own... Um, obviously, it's all, it's all my own understanding. Black bit now? Oh no, it, it seamlessly transitioned, which is surprising. Anyway, sorry. Um, yeah, um, yeah, no training in um, fitness or like teaching or qualifications. Um, but it's kind of like uh, what I've just learned on my own. So yeah, this is hitting your lats, which if you don't know, um, if you try and hug yourself, it's kind of like your sides and your back, kind of that level just under your armpits. Um, and this is a lat pull down, so you're pulling down. Uh, it's kind of nice to um, lean backwards slightly, as you see me do there, and just bring the bar uh, just below your, well, below your chin, hopefully to the top of your chest. It's kind of hard to tell from the angles in the video um, how low down the bar is going, because if you look at it from, like, uh, if you don't know how, like, camera views work, it looks like I'm just bringing it to my forehead, potentially. But I can tell you that um, it's going down uh, below my chin. Or at least at my chin, I'd say. I'm not going to lie. It was going to about my chin. Um, if I wanted to squeeze it down even more, um, I could have dropped the weight slightly and uh, brought it down to the top of my chest. So this was a back workout. Um, I started with some seated cable rows um, for about uh, three sets of ten. Then I did some uh, bent over rows um, with, dumb with dumbbell, yeah. Not a dumbbell, a barbell. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Is my phone going off? Sorry. Um, oh, this was a cool uh, angle I liked. Kind of sucks that I'm not in focus, but it's kind of nice that I'm not in focus as well. I don't know. It, it looks cool. So uh, I put the, my uh, phone on the actual um, the weight itself, and as I'm pulling down, the weight goes up in the air, and you can just. I, I should have had a more neutral face, I think. Just something that isn't me like really red in the face looking like I'm taking a shit but um yeah uh, this is some more seated rows but instead of having a cable uh, it's the machine although it, it does use a cable obviously to pull the weights up um, yeah so generally speaking when I'm at the gym I don't do really heavy weight um, I kind of try and just feel it in the muscles that I'm trying to hit trying to uh, you know engage the correct muscles instead of just hoying the weight for use of a better word just lugging the weight around to try and imitate the motion i would much rather have a uh, a lighter weight and actually do the movement um as good as i know how um because well i don't know it's, it, it depends you know obviously there's a time and a place for lifting heavy weight and there's no excuse me, really wrong or right answer. It's kind of, you know, how you're feeling. Um, and obviously you want to switch it up. You don't always want to um, do the same thing or the same style um, all the time because you basically, um, and if you're into fitness at all, you probably heard this before, but shock the muscle. I'm talking as if I know what I'm talking about, but I mean, I have been doing it for like three years or so, uh, starting from a very amateur kind of state to uh, now when I kind of go into the gym I, I know what I'm doing and um, yeah I mean like, like the physique itself starting to um, push its way through like um, I started off very very very, very slim um, like my wrists are very slim because you can't build anything on your wrists and my forearms are still quite um, small um, but yeah so my, my seated row, look at me go, yeah. So <laughs> I don't know what to say, but yeah. So I'm just pulling the weight towards me, trying to squeeze my back in. Um, there aren't any like posing shots in this video. Um, I might wait and do a, uh, a progress video. Instead of it being like World of Warcraft progression kill, it'll be like a IRL um, fitness progression. Uh, kind of where I, I started and where I am now just having a quick rest and then I uh, <laughs> turned the goddamn video off um, but yeah I, my phone kept uh, filling up 
So I deleted about, I think 300, 350 or more uh, pictures and videos off my phone in order to uh, do this recording. So rest in pieces, uh, photos and fond memories. <laughs> but no, they're, they're all like junk uh, photos and duplicates that I deleted. And then I did some like crunches on a crunch machine thing for some abs and then I'm just doing some leg raises to end off. So uh, yeah, a cable row, uh, bent over barbell row, um, then lat pull down, then some more seated rows on machine and that was about it. I mean I could have done some deadlifts but I didn't really want to. I've kind of been two back routines without doing deadlifts so I should probably do some more. That's kind of fun and there's plenty to talk about if it's the uh, Olympic lifts because uh, it's a more technical exercise versus just here's a machine, pull it this way, l release and you're done. Um, so deadlifts are, are fun and it's also one of those uh, exercises where you actually uh, use a lot more weight and it's kind of you know when you're having a banter between people who go to the gym how much you lift while I deadlift X amount or I bench press whatever as I'm sure people are familiar with um, as well as squats which people don't normally talk about because it involves leg day so here's uh, just some clip of me afterwards hopping on down to get some food and uh, yeah that's pretty much it so uh, if you like this video thumbs it up let me know what you think and uh, yeah if I get some good support it's something that I very well may do again in the future so cheers and uh, peace peace <laughs>